Hi guys, it's Andy from Man City Fan TV. Well, sorry, I'm a bit <laughs> scruffy. Uh, I'm absolutely full of mud and sweat and you name it. Um, been doing a load of gardening today and uh, see that path behind me just here. I'm trying to, I'm trying to kill all the weeds and uh, trying to uh, kill the grass actually because it's a cobbled. It's actually a cobbled. Um, Hi mate, how are you? How England's finest? Damn music, yeah, no, 4 0. I, I didn't see any of it. Chris 22 City, yeah, Man United got battered, they did know. Uh, I haven't seen any of it, I just was coming through on my phone and things like that. So I've been trying to get this path here, kill all the. Oh, this has literally been. Hi, King of Assist, this has literally been over the winter one big garden, but underneath here is a load of cobbles and it's really nice pathway to the back. Uh, hi mate, thought Guerrero looked good yesterday. No, I, I disagree, Tom. I thought first half, I thought he was really, he looked laboured. Um, and I'm just, I think, again, again, I think he's he's probably tired, if I'm honest with you. And uh, I was really, like I said, I was really surprised. It's boiling today, it's absolutely roasting. I'm sweating cobs, I'm absolutely filthy. I need a shower, but... Liverpool game's going to start shortly, so I'm going to have a look at that. Uh, Kevin De Bruyne should be fit. <sighs> Pep said, uh, doesn't look good. Uh, got a great assist, Tom, absolutely. Yeah, of course he did. Um, hi there, number city from Africa, Namibia. I hope that Avril Smith, I hope that's number one fan uh, from uh, Namibia. England's finest on Lovings and Jenko. Um, yeah, I mean, it, it, it rarely put, rarely puts a foot wrong. PSG won League One. No surprise there, mate. Let's hope uh, they keep Oli for next season. <laughs> yeah. I've just been uh, I did actually just sit down because I've like literally from half ten this morning I've been in the garden. Um he is he is, yeah, exactly. That's why just like we should be resting David Silver. Um didn't need a rest. I was watching uh, Hi Shire, how are you buddy? Um I was watching uh, House and on uh, just sat down just thought I'd flick on and see what uh, Goldbridge and House are saying and uh, he's just absolutely I mean, it, you can imagine me doing this vlog with you now and I'm effing at you and telling you to f off and again don't tell me this don't tell me oh, it was so funny so sad Man United losing oh so sad yeah it was uh, would David Silva start Wednesday or Foden I think Foden might even start with David Silva wouldn't surprise me, and if he goes for the same Bernardo on the right uh, and Sterling on the left, it's just um, we'll see. Do you think eight City players put in the transfer request? No, absolutely garbage, mate. Richie Miller in Virginia, um, you need to contact some of our contacts out there, mate, of uh, Virginia Blues, um, and have a chat with them. I think it, it, it was from ESPN UK, which is utter guff. Avril Smith sitting in front of the television, keep my fingers crossed, come on Cardiff, yeah, I'm going to go and watch it, it's just started, but I just thought I'd do a very quick vlog, just to check in with you guys, because I've um, got a couple of things I want to very quickly talk about, and uh, if you've got any questions for us, uh, that you want us to cover, Foden to get a hat-trick on Wednesday, hey, listen, Pep absolutely loves him, and if not only for, like Ray said on his live vlog, so don't forget, uh, check that out, and also give this a thumbs up, um, Ray said that he ran more than anybody yesterday, which is incredible, because Bernardo Silva, not many people run more than Bernardo Silva, but Foden did, can't wait to see United getting trashed by City Blue Moon, yeah, Gerard Mulcair, Claire, I absolutely agree, let's wait and see, but... It wouldn't surprise me if a uh, United Barca style turned up on Wednesday. It'd be bloody typical after that performance against uh, Everton that uh, they suddenly decide to play. I mean, they're, they're an absolute disgrace. Liverpool could <laughs> gonna get an offside goals and die penalties. Well, it wouldn't surprise me, but uh, another six-one or bigger rag thrashing. Um, John Walters, it would be absolutely amazing if we could do that, but um, somehow I think it'll be a little bit tighter than that. Sterling never gets the rest. It's about time signing. And Bernardo start. Well, Bernardo has started loads of games, I must admit. He's, he's played most games this season. Uh, he's had a little bit of a rest lately. Uh, and Sterling's been rested. Let's don't forget. Andre Bennett, hopefully we don't get back. Like, well, that wouldn't surprise me, mate. And It's one of those where... 
you sort of look at it and think, I'd have preferred the rice to have won today. Well, yeah, not for me. Get them smashed every week. 4 0, I mean, that's devastating for them. I'm getting scared of the silent situation. Don't worry about it. Pep is. Uh, Pep's used to managing. I mean, he's, he's managed. You look at the players that Pep's managed. Uh, prediction for the Liverpool game? Who knows? Thoughts on the United game? The garbage. Just they're turning up whenever they want. And I don't think it's anything to. Uh, Andre Bennett? Nothing yet, mate. Um, Kevin De Bruyne has this amazing ability to be out for a week and come back in three days. So don't be surprised, and you heard it here first, don't be surprised if Kevin De Bruyne is fit for Wednesday night, honestly. Um, I don't think he will be, but don't be surprised if he does. Uh, United Thursday night football, looks like it been stuffing myself with eggs all day. Did you have a good Easter? Um, I've been in my garden all day, mate. Doing six hours of work, I'm knackered. Uh, Sounded start against Tottenham both lads will run. I'm not sure about that because Let's face it, um, Sam has been brought on and when he's come on, all right, it's only 15, 20 minutes, but not really done a great deal. So, you know, I don't know what, the, I, I honestly don't know what the problem, I don't know what the problem is. I've absolutely no idea. Um, there's something, now it could be absolutely nothing to do with footballing reasons. There could be something outside like... When people were questioning about David Silva being away and things like that. There could be something we don't know about and the club, the club are, are keeping quiet about it. So um, if there was a real, for me, if there was a real attitude problem and with Pep and uh, uh, you watch Ray's video, good. Um, yeah, weather in Manchester has been absolutely scorching all day. I think it's been about 27 degrees, so it's been amazing. Um, I honestly believe if there was something sinister with... Pep and uh, thinking about his attitude, he won't even be on the subs bench. Pep, Pep will just bin him off and say, "Go away, have two weeks holiday because your mind's not on the game, and I don't want you near the team." And so I don't think it's anything like that. We don't know. Maybe there is something going on in the background that we don't know about. Ryan, it's twenty-four degrees up north. It's probably about that now, mate. Um, it was about a few hours ago. I think it was about twenty-seven degrees here. It was boiling. Um, so we don't know. So I wouldn't, I wouldn't, and I certainly would not be rushing into these ESPN UK garbage nonsense headline, clickbait headlines. So um, I think David Sill should go bold again. He was cabaled again, you mean? Yeah, absolutely. We've been calling for that. But uh, hey, nothing to take away from his. Uh, he's just tired. He, he's played so, he's been covering Fernandinho, Kevin De Bruyne for so long. Um, he, he needs a rest, he needs a proper rest, but we're in the business end and I'm sure he's got four or five more games in him where he can influence. And it wasn't any surprise yesterday at the match when he brought him on to sort of like, uh, you know, basically look after the final sort of 10, 15 minutes. Uh, Bernardo Silva, yeah, I don't know whether he's the closest, but he's right up there. My mum's a United fan and can't take defeat. None of them can take defeat, mate, honestly. Uh, Sri Lankan territory, yeah, I mean, that's just absolutely disgraceful. Uh, our thoughts from Man City Fan TV are with the people out there. They've been killed and injured. And, and in this day and age, you know, it's just, it's um, it's one of those. Sorry if I pause there. Sorry, I pause there, yeah. Um, not nice at all. Um, and of all days, so it's no surprise that on Easter Sunday, uh, for Christians and things like that, it's um, uh, this, these type of things happen. So, yeah, my thoughts are with all the family and people who've been killed, injured or associated and uh, with this particular attack. It's awful, absolutely devastating. But um, what I wanted to ask you is, um, I am going to go, Kamal, I'm going to go and watch it now. My lad's just in the... Uh, I can hear it. My lad's just in the. Uh, we're in the. He's in the kitchen area just outside here, so uh, he's watching, and I can hear it in the background. So uh, I was just. Uh, I was just finishing some jobs in the garden and thought I'd do a quick vlog because uh, what I want you to do is, if you've got any questions, call me. How are you, buddy? Um, if you've got any questions for us that you want us to answer, um, free of charge. Won't charge you. You don't have to. Uh, you don't have to send any questions you don't have to send us money to answer you 
uh, your questions on Man City Fan TV, we'll answer you free of charge. If you want us to do a video or something, we've done loads of videos um, and spoke about loads of subjects for you guys that you've um, you've sent in uh, free of charge. We don't charge you any money for questions. Uh, but um, Palace all over Arsenal. Wow, well, uh, I've got a feeling Palace are going to win today. Um, but if you've got any questions about something, there are a couple of um, transfer rumours, big signings for next season. Okay, Cheshire Homebrew, you've got that. That's going to be one. Um, when you say big signings, uh, we might talk about signings, not not necessarily always big. Um, will you do a players rating video? Definitely. Uh, Kamal, uh, because obviously the season's not over yet, um, don't forget, come back to us and say, look, remember Andy, I said you were going to do a, a video on the player ratings. Just remind us, because we've got so many things in the pipeline that we're going to do. Uh, City need Kante, good shout. Free on like a Steam Cup, well, yeah. He likes to charge $40 a month to answer a one question, 10 minute video uh, every four or five months. So, uh, what's that, $250 to get a 10 minute video uh, question? Mm, yeah, not for me, I'm afraid. So you guys, if you've got questions, we'll do it for free. Um, no problem whatsoever. Um, but yeah, some good questions there, so maybe we'll do that. Um, six likes, seven likes, go on, come on, get that up. Ray said I get 100 likes, but we've only got about 28 on today because everyone's probably watching the uh, Liverpool game, which I'm going to go and do now. United are out of top four now, surely. I agree, Simon Stevens. So uh, Spurs, that gives you another chance, buddy. Um, so hopefully, uh, we, we don't want to see United in the top four, if I'm, uh, I'm honest. Cardiff are having a go, let's hope so, Avril. Um, so if you get any questions let me know we've got um, he's going men I'm, I'm assuming that's mental uh, Gerard <laughs> for other mantles um, but uh, I want more than 10 minutes actually for <laughs> so would I well once every five months yeah yeah I think I'd, I'd want a lot more than that uh, we're gonna bat United let's hope so come on um, so yeah if you've got your questions leave them below this video don't forget you've Give us a thumbs up. Come on, I'm only on ten. That's not good enough. Uh, Man, oh, it's all right. So just just under fifty percent. So um, sitting here, defence midfielder. We do call me. We'll maybe discuss that in the uh, transfer video. Eleven. Oh, there you go. So you ask for it, and we and you give it us. The, they're absolute superstars. Um, <coughs> what else? <coughs> There's some <coughs> some transfer. Um, Hello Andy, hello Ocean Rage, how are you? Um, still like Tiago from Bayern. Well listen, um, thank you very much for checking in. Don't forget, get your questions in. There's more sort of um, uh, transfer, sort of speculation. I didn't have time today to do a video on it, uh, but I'm going to do one tomorrow. Uh, and some young kids that we're looking at, forget Joao Felix, um, some other young kids that we're looking at, and uh, I'm going to do a video on those. Uh, tomorrow and uh, maybe do a live vlog um, it's as easy and because I know it's bank holiday Monday but anyway guys listen thank you very much don't forget check in I'm gonna go and watch the Liverpool game and uh, have a wonderful bank holiday Sunday and we'll see you tomorrow Ooh, you don't want to see that <laughs>